Donna Schwartz here from the Everything Saxophone Podcast. We're at Day 2 NAM. I'm at the IMEO booth. You can see in the background those rotating saxophones. Pretty awesome. I'm here with Oleg Raskin. We're going to talk about this awesome product. Welcome to the podcast. Thank you. So tell us about your product, the IMEO product, when it started, what was the idea um, for creating it? Uh, just we, we was looking for some solution to be able to practice anywhere or anytime, real practice for saxophone players. And uh, we made it by ourselves, first of, first of all for myself and then for all of us. Got it. So the, the main idea for this product then is for practicing, but is it also for performance as well? Could people go on stage and perform with it? Once it's yours, up to you. We bring it as a practice tool because mostly we are looking for to support guys to be able to practice more and be better musician. It's never instead of main horn. Sure. It's not to replace saxophone. It's additional practice tool. So you could practice at midnight. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime. It's more than only silence practice, but in general, yes. Okay, because I've been watching them and uh, I've been hearing jamming coming from your booth. Yeah. Okay, so talk about talk about how this works in, ter in terms of getting different sounds. How does it work? How does someone use this? Oh, it's very easy. It's like any MIDI controller you can use with various sounds. Okay, email come with it. Incredible sounds by Emacs Plus company, okay. Respiro. We really love them. Each instrument comes with a license, but also we love all audio modeling sounds. It's our friends from Swarm sounds, you know. Got it. Okay. It must must be sounds for wind MIDI controllers to be able to support velocity, just to dynamic control, you know. It's really a lot. Okay. Now let me ask you a couple of questions, and when it comes to that. Do you have a special app that you use with this? Yeah, it's come with Respiro. Respiro is a sounds. Okay, it's uh, you can use it standalone with uh, Windows machine or Macintosh or iPhone or iPad. Great, that's what I wanted to know. And um, if people have a, a digital audio workstation, a DAW, they would also use that with yeah. this as well. It's standalone as as well as a plugin, of course. And in terms of blowing into it, like I see over here, um, I saw some of your special mouthpieces, but could people use their own mouthpiece you to mean, blow into you this? Mean this? Yes, blue I, one? Yeah, I see the blue one over there. So would that be the mouthpiece that they would use, or could they use their own saxophone mouthpiece? We can play with conventional alto mouthpiece. It doesn't work like on saxophone. It's a kind of extension just to keep it. Uh, I don't use by myself. But some, some some guys play with conventional. Uh, this one we made. There we it's go. new model. Really cool color. <laughs> I like this. This is nice. The That's previous really cool. looks like this. It's same, you know, just it's same. Got it. Okay. It's we printed from uh, antibacterial flexible. Okay, material. Mm. Mostly I use it on fly a train myself best preset straight neck with no mouthpiece okay got it possible also you can play with no blowing we have mode play without blowing just fingers oh and maybe solfege maybe oh. thing yeah wow all right that's cool that's yeah. interesting yeah and and with this okay so if you're using this mouthpiece you're going to have more control over your articulation everything about sound production and arti in articulation as well, embouchure is on saxophone, guys. I don't believe in it. It's never will replace something. Will not replace it. We oh, must. Sure. We must. But you, as well, you are able to control your tongue. I want you will try. Okay, great. And yeah, and actually, I'm going to want to hear somebody. Uh, definitely hear some demos on this. You will sure. try after. Okay, anytime. <laughs> great. Awesome. Awesome. So. Uh, you were saying though that you could use a conventional alto sax mouthpiece. You couldn't use like a tenor mouthpiece. It would have to be uh, yeah, possible. Possible. For example, our friend uh, Ramon, oh, you, yeah. you're Ramon from Travel Sax, has uh, some uh, kinds uh, of uh, necks for uh, soprano, alto, and tenor. We don't have it because we don't think it's necessary. I saw a few guys printed by themselves. I don't think it's necessary. So we don't do it. 
Got it. Okay. We do it with Alto because we, we ship it with the Alto mouthpiece. It's oh, come okay. together in bundle with a conventional Alto mouthpiece, this one, and straight neck and covered neck. Oh, okay, great. Got it. Okay, and um, you also have something else that's new that you just told me as well. That's not a saxophone, if you wanted to show us as well. Uh, you mean uh, it's not uh, absolutely, guys. It's not a saxophone. You mean the clarinet? It's not a clarinet. <laughs> oh, okay. It's it's clarinet a digital practice tool. Okay. Okay. It's it's pretty new product. It's only yesterday the first time we show it to guys. That's great. It's not released for uh, for sales. Okay. Okay. But it works already as well, and we hope uh, by end of this year we'll be able to bring it to the market. That's awesome. People waiting for it. Yes, they are. All right, and, and we're le uh, we're leaking the secret here. There's no <laughs> secrets here. Just practice. No secrets. <laughs> this is not saxophone, I mean, because it's not alto and not soprano. It's our patent design. It's something between soprano and alto. It must be comfortable for all of us to be able to practice. Yeah, and I was holding it before, and it is very comfortable, and it yeah. looks, looks really beautiful, too. You can see it right there. And are there different? There are different finishes. I could see this. Three, is three different finishes: classical gold in, in the middle, okay, uh, vintage, and uh, black nickel. My my favorite color. Yeah, that's awesome. It looks great. Yeah, anything new coming up this year for for you uh, guys? Only firmware. Soon we will release new firmware. We're working for months for it. We we made great beta testing with a lot of guys around the world. We do it together with Emox Plus company as well. We are good friends with them, not only Respiro, more than it. And it's gonna be really cool, cool firmware with possibility to customize your own fingering, altissimo, detune, change resistance, a lot of... Awesome. Uh, in general, it's same instrument, just new firmware. Previous guys will be able to update it and new customers will get it with new, that's it. Got it. Yeah. And where can people find you online? On our website or social media, emailmusic.com is our uh, website. Uh, email, Instagram, Facebook. Oh, okay. Got it. It's, so re it's really easy. Okay, and emio, mu emio music, E M E O, that's how we spell it, emailmusic.com, if you want to check it out. And there you go. <laughs> Wanted to thank you for your time, Oleg. Thank you for your time, Donna. Awesome. It was a great pleasure for us. Thank you. Thank you.